Which of the following is the correct formula for sodium phosphate? A. NAP B. NAPO3 C. Na3PO4 or D. Na3PO4 2. To determine the formula of a compound given its name, we need to first classify the compound, then apply the rules for that type of compound. Sodium phosphate is an ionic compound. We know it's ionic because sodium is a metallic element. Cations are generally derived from metallic elements. In this case, we know that the cation of the compound is the sodium ion. The first part of the name of any ionic compound is the name of the cation. We should know that the sodium ion has a charge of plus 1 based on its location in the periodic table, since it belongs to group 1A. The rest of the name of the compound is associated with the anion. In this case, it's phosphate. The formula of phosphate is PO4 with a negative 3 charge. How do we know this? It's trivial. We look it up. Better yet, we just memorize it. Chances are, your teacher expects you to memorize it anyways. At this point, we can eliminate choices A and B. Neither choice has a PO4 group in the given formula. How do we determine the correct answer from choices C and D? A compound is electrically neutral. The formula for an ionic compound should reflect the simplest set of ions that give a total charge of zero. So let's examine choice D. The subscript for sodium is 3, and the entire formula for phosphate has a subscript of 2. Each sodium ion has a charge of plus 1, and each phosphate ion has a charge of negative 3. Positive 1 plus another positive 1 plus one more positive one, plus a negative three, plus another negative three, equals negative three. Therefore, the total charge implied in the formula is negative three, and choice D is therefore wrong. If we look at choice C, we can see that the total charge is zero. The formula given in choice C implies that there are three sodium ions for every phosphate ion. Three times positive one gives us a total positive charge of plus 3. 1 times negative 3 gives us a total negative charge of negative 3. The overall charge is then 0, and the correct answer is C.